adventurers, it's Jen and Mama, and we are at Appalachian Brewing Company today in Gettysburg. Here's the menu. Appalachian Brewing Company. They have quite a variety of choices. We decided to start off with the Canadian poutine. Sounds amazing. And the roasted red beet and arugula salad. Sounds amazing also. And then we're going to go in for the hog wild, which is right here. And we're going to just split everything. They have quite an extensive menu of uh, brew house classics. Their um, beer batter fish and chips is very good. I've had that before. Their pierogies are very good. Never had the meatloaf, but I've heard good things about it. Quesadillas as well. Also quite an extensive list of craft sodas and beverages, wine, spirits. And they also have uh, beers and sodas to go. These are all made in-house. Uh, currently I have the birch beer, which is very good. And Mama got the house special of water. There's the poutine. It looks really delish. Check it out, Mama. Yum. Baby fries and cheese. What? What's that girlfriend? Okay. You have a girlfriend? All right. Got the thumbs up from Mama. Mama says, check out the poutine. There's the pulled pork in all of its glory. Beer battered onion rings. How's that onion ring? All right. There's the little ball with the ABC Appalachian Brewing Company. Here's the cross section of the pulled pork sandwich. Delish. I'm getting ready to dig into that now. All right, we're gonna check it out. Wow. That's some good pulled pork right there. And here is the red beet and arugula salad with the poppy seed dressing. Oh, it's awesome as well. Time to dress the salad because it's naked. Another good item on the menu. Mm -hmm. I like the dressing. The dressing is very good. It's a poppy seed. Matter of fact, there's still some seeds in here, so let's just. There you go. Now you can see the poppy seeds. Just a slight observation with the red beet arugula salad. Um, I would say it needs just a few more beets. Um, and the other thing is they have feta in the salad, feta cheese. And if it were me making it, I would probably put goat cheese and I would replace the feta cheese with goat cheese. Only because it's a um, bit of a smoother texture and not quite so salty. Because the dressing itself has enough salt in it um, to complement the sweet. So I wouldn't let that deter me from getting it. So it's good. Overall, everything's been very good. Happy birthday to you. What's this? Happy birthday to you. What? Happy birthday, Jean Chan. Yeah. Happy birthday to you. Yay! Yay! <laughs> Have to give a mint. 
or some merchandise they have for sale. Sweatshirt, t-shirts, vest.